To replace the rear door latch, you will first need to remove the rear door panel. Please see the link at the end of this video for instructions on how to do that procedure. You will also need to disconnect the battery and give the system time to discharge. Again, see the links at the end of this video for proper procedures. Once the battery's been disconnected and the system discharged, you're going to disconnect the electrical connection on the side airbag by pulling it straight out. Then slowly peel the vapor barrier off of the door. Be careful not to tear the barrier while removing it. If the vapor barrier tears, green arrow, replace it. The red arrow points to the butyl seal you are separating from the door. Peel the vapor barrier, green arrow, off the door until you can see the window motor, as indicated by the red arrow. Looking inside the door towards the latch, you can see the latch, yellow arrow, door support, red arrow, and the door handle release bracket, green arrow. To remove the latch, you will have to remove the door support and the exterior door handle and release bracket. Again, please see the link at the end of this video for our tech article on rear door handle removing. Working at the outer edge of the door, peel the tape, green arrow, away from the door to expose the door support retaining tabs, as indicated by the red arrows. Be sure to replace this piece of tape when reinstalling. Press the release tabs while reaching inside the door and rotate the door support clockwise when you're facing the interior of the door. Remove the door support from the door. Remove the exterior door handle and release bracket. Again, please see the link at the end of this video for our tech article on rear door handle removal. Next, you have to detach the wiring harness, red arrows, from the door. Push the bottom of the retainer up, shown in the insert, and pull it out of the door. Then remove the entire clip with the harness from the door. Working at the outer edge of the door, remove the guard from the door latch. Press the retaining tabs, as indicated by the red arrows, in towards the guard and hold while pulling the guard out of the door. Once detached, remove the guard, as indicated by the red arrow, from the door. Working on the door latch, remove the lock rod, red arrow. Feed the curved bottom portion of the rod out of the lever on the latch, green arrow. Now move to the door module. Disconnect the door latch electrical connector, as indicated by the green arrow, by pulling it straight out. Then feed the wiring harness through the door vapor barrier. Remove the three T30 torque door latch fasteners, indicated by the red arrows. Once the fasteners are removed, lift the latch slightly to detach the plastic tab, as indicated by the green arrow. Then remove the door latch from the body by sliding it down and removing it at an angle through the opening in the door. To install the new latch, reverse the order of these steps. Remember to check the function of the latch before installing the door panel. I suggest closing the latch with a flathead screwdriver, red arrow, while the door is open. Then open it using the cables once you've attached them. This will ensure it is working. Thanks for watching. Click here to view the original article along with hundreds of other DIY content for your car.